Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me Ubuntu Albai and in this video I want to show you how to enable trim in Ubuntu 13.04. Uh, before I start I want to say that it is really important that you go ahead and just go to Google or something like that and uh, just read about trim in Linux because you need to understand trim in Linux. You basically want to know what you do when you in, uh, when you enable trim, because if you don't, you might mess stuff up. So I'm just saying that, please, please, for your own sake, go ahead and go to Google and just read about enabling trim in uh, enabling trim support in Linux because it is important because. If you don't know what to do, you might screw things up. Okay, just a heads up. Now, <laughs> uh, like I said, I want to show you how you enable trim in uh, Ubuntu or in Linux in general. So if you go ahead and open up your terminal, right? And then type in sudo get it and then uh, slash etc slash f stab and then slash again. Press enter and then type in your password. Press enter once again. Now right here you see a lot of stuff, but if you <laughs> read about, like I said in the beginning of the video, if you already uh, read about enabling trim in Linux, you would know what this is. Right here, uh, I wanna say again, uh, um, so it's important also that uh, or you might need to uh, make a copy of this it's if uh, something goes wrong so I'm just gonna go right ahead now if you see where it says uh, ext4 right here uh, you see it says errors equals remount blah 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 what you want to do is you want to type in this car and then a comma right this discard means enable trim basically when you write discard and then comma and then hit save file trim is basically enabled on your SSD um, now again if you go ahead and read about uh, enabling trim in SSD like I've said like a hundred times in this uh, video <laughs> then uh, it's important to uh, figure out which way you want to enable trim. So as you can see, I wrote down discard and then comma. All right, so if I hit save file and uh, I reboot my machine, trim is basically enabled and that's how to do it. So I wanna show you one thing more. If you go ahead and write Noah time and then comma again, no spaces, at all. Just no time, comma, discard, and then comma. No time means that it will limit the writing speeds to, uh, to your SSD, which means uh, a longer SSD lifetime. You expand the lifetime of your SSD with no time. Uh, so right now you can go ahead and hit save and just save the file and reboot your machine. You can do more you can do less. It's Linux, it's it's free. Um, but this is basically all you have to do to enable trim at least. So um, just hit save and uh, close this file and you know just save and uh, that's it. So thank you guys for watching. If you want me to make more SSD videos in Linux, then uh, just hit the like button and uh, you know leave a comment saying that you want more SSD videos. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, that's it. Have a nice day, guys, and um, I'll catch you guys in the next one. So uh, peace out, Girl Scout.